Hi guys, it's Madness Makeup, and today we're going to be testing out a few products, but we're going to be mainly focusing on Marc Jacobs products, um, just like this one and these ones. So don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and comment down below, and we will get right into it. Alright guys, so I ordered some stuff from Sephora. I um, tested out the Olay, I think. I think that's how you pronounce it shampoo and hair oil i haven't tested out the hair mask yet because the hair oil is kind of like a mask so i will alternate between all three of my um leave-in mask treatments i can't get this palette out oh it's so pretty i love it look at that packaging all right it does come with a actually i like that protective layer oh my god these are so pretty <gasps> holy crap oh my gosh yeah so i'm pretty sure this is like the limited edition gold one so that's what i got and um i am so excited to use it i don't think the shade names are in there but they are in the back of the palette oh my god i can't open it oh oh cool i just click it yeah they're not in the palette but they're on the back and they're also on the packaging so yeah let me put this in here so it doesn't fall out these are the mark jacobs enamored so this is a high shine lip lacquer so that means like lip gloss this is the lip gloss in the shade cherry moon very pink Damn it, I was gonna do a red lip, but I am a sucker for pink. And maybe it's not pigmented, so maybe it'll be like a sheer wash of color. And then this is a liquid highlighter, also from Marc Jacobs, and it's in the shade Moonlit. It's a really pretty pink champagne color. I think it'll go well with that lip, actually. So yeah, and then we're gonna be testing out the Urban Decay All Nighter Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray. They gave me a little sample size. And we're going to be trying out this primer. So, yeah. Um, I will go do my face makeup up until my highlight. And I'll get, um, like, a powder highlight that matches this color. Or at least something pretty similar. Um, so we could just put that on my nose and my above my lips. So, yeah. Or my cupid's bow. You know what I mean. All right, I'll be right back. Okay guys, so here's all the products I use. So for my primer, I use the Urban Decay All Nighter Face Primer. So it's a lawn wear foundation grip. And then I use my Bare Minerals Bare Pro Powder Foundation in the shade Fair 1. And it looks like that. I didn't use a lot, so we're very light coverage today. Then I use the Item Beauty Cheek Money in the shade Vibes for contour, which is like the shadow part of my cheeks. And then I use the Rimmel London Natural Bronzer for bronzer today. And this is in the shade Duo 20 Sunshine. And then I use the Rimmel London Maxi Blush, um, and it's in the shade 001 Third Base. It's very pretty. Very pink. And I also use this to prep my lips. So this is the La or Lasting Smiles Peppermint Cream Organic Lip Balm. And I use my trusty dusty Makeup Revolution Luxury Baking Powder in the shade Ghost. My concealer is getting a little dry, so I think I might buy like um maybe a hydrating elf camo concealer in like a darker shade than I already have. I do like this face primer. It was very tacky, so I think it held on to my powder foundation really well. And I also like the All Nighter so far. I set my blush and stuff with that. So, let me get the palette out. Okay. This is their liquid highlighter in the shade Moonlit, which is number 10. So let's try this. Okay, so 
going to put there and then we're gonna blend it out I don't know if I need to dip in I'll use the other side this one I feel like I can bring down this way but they're definitely at two different places Shit, I can't get the brush back in okay Let's take a kabuki brush and let's blend this crazy streak out. Mm. It's kind of natural looking. We'll put on a second layer. It's like paint. This brush is so flimsy and it like, you have to squeeze it to get back in the thing. All right, there we go. I feel like now you can see my highlighter pretty well. So if you want a super natural, gl or a natural glow, I would only recommend like one coat or if you want like something subtle. But if you want some more, I might suggest like two coats. I did not grab my Anastasia palette, but I'm gonna go um, put some on my nose and do my eyebrows and prime my eyes and I will be right back with you guys shortly. All right, friends, so I am back. And let's do the eyes. I'm gonna take, um, the white shade so i'm guessing it might be at last is the name of that yes and i'm just going to set my brow bone a little bit pretty pigmented i have pretty fair skin <laughs> well it's a little light i guess and I'm going to take that next shade, and it's called I Have. There's a little fallout in this palette, so if you're not a fan of that, I would be wary of this palette. I don't mind, though. So we're just going to pop that color in our crease with our round crease brush. So. Okay. That's as far as I'm going to go with this eye, because I accidentally, well, I didn't accidentally, I put um, eye primer on both eyes. All right. It's a little more shake up than I wanted it to be, but we're gonna be okay. So I'm taking this Farah um, brush. It's the Blender Brush 25 EL. And I'm just blending the top of the shade out. Sorry, my mom's laughing. <laughs> She's a very loud laugher. Or she has a very loud laugh. I don't know. Okay. Here we go. Alright, so... Mm -hmm. What I will do... I kind of want to mess with the dark gold right there. And then I want to put that, like... So the dark gold's gonna be on the inner half, and then the shimmer with the, like the gold specks will be on the outer. It's a little chunky, so I think this actually has glitter in it. So I'm just going to put that on. Oh, very pretty. Let me try to get a man recorder. There we go. All right, perfect. That's what I wanted to do. Now I have glitter on the top, but that's okay. Let's get that on then. All right. And then this is what that shade looks swatched. Sorry if you could still hear her. Like I said, she's very loud. Whoa, this looks like a black and not a dark brown. That's okay. No worries. 
everything will be good. I did get a little on my under eye. I tried to figure that out. <laughs> I have an idea actually. Okay, so I'm gonna blend this in. And I think I'm gonna put more of the gold. Sorry, this video is like really long. I'll try to shorten it up in editing, but yeah, the shade is not bad. So I'm gonna dip a little back into that gold and I'm just gonna overlap the two. Make it really glittery and really pretty. Perfect. We're very smoky eyed today. Yeah, so I'm just gonna keep blending a little. And then I will clean this up. So I'm gonna do this on the other eye, clean my eyes up, and I will be right back with you guys to try the lip gloss and we'll see what it looks like then. All right guys, so let's try this out. So here is Cherry Moon. Very Barbie pink. Okay, really pigmented. Kind of tastes minty, so maybe it's also plumping as well. Because minty is usually something I associate plumping with. Your girl can use some plumping. Oh. That side is not so cute. I love it. Very Barbie. I was gonna do a red lip because I thought it would go really good. I'm like wearing um burgundy. But um I ordered pink, so yeah. I think this is gorgeous actually. I really like it. Yeah, so this is our look today. Um for my inner corner I just put like my Anastasia Moonchild um palette in there. It's the pink heart one. But yeah, this is like a really pretty look. And um, yeah, I really actually enjoy this. Kind of sad that he's shutting his brand, brand down, but you know, sometimes things happen. Oh, and that um, dark shade was a shade love, by the way. But yeah, I'm actually glad I got this. It's really gorgeous. And I love like the shimmers. They kind of have real glitters in them, I think. So be careful if you're like a contact wearer like me. Um, but yeah, super pretty. All right, I just can't stop looking at them. Yeah, I will um, review this really quick after this video, probably like tomorrow morning. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one. All right, bye.